Let's go to weather and traffic on this Friday morning. As mentioned, school year fast approaching. Maybe this is the final weekend getaway for the summer for you and the kiddos. Here's cabin cast and a daily chance of scattered thunderstorms from Mount Lemon to the White Mountains and up in northern Arizona. Daytime highs up on Mount Lemon into the low to mid 60s this weekend. Upper 70s for Pine Top Sholo and low to mid 70s up in Flag. Here in southern Arizona, starting in Metro Tucson this afternoon, mid to upper 90s for daytime highs and a 30% chance of showers and thunderstorms. The best bet for scattered storms today across Santa Cruz and Cochise counties, 80s and 90s for highs there. Live look at Doppler radar. We had a band of light to moderate rain move in overnight here in Tucson, dropping four hundredths of an inch of rain officially at the airport. Well, that band is drying up as it pushes off to the west and should cease to exist over the next hour or two. Big picture looks like this. High pressure off to our east, ample monsoon moisture in play, and a mid-level disturbance just south of Tucson. The one question mark today is going to be atmospheric energy, and that may hold widespread thunderstorms in check as we're getting into the afternoon and early evening hours. Steering winds aloft this morning, not looking all that bad, but notice on future casts here, very little activity in Metro Tucson. I don't think it'll be this quiet here in the Old Pueblo, a 30% chance of Metro Thunder prime time between 3 and 9 p.m. But again, the better chance of scattered thunderstorms for our friends in Nogales, Sierra Vista, Benson, and Douglas. Tomorrow might be the most active day for the monsoon out of the next seven, 40% chance of Metro storms. Once we get beyond that, your rain chances start to decrease. Decrease. Reason being, high pressure off to our east starts to drift toward Reno, Nevada. And if you've lived here long enough, you know that is not a favorable pattern to get scattered storms going. We'll call it a 30% chance of storms on Sunday, decreasing to the isolated hit and miss variety much of next week. And as we dry out a little bit, we heat up as well. A hot 100 back on Tuesday.